Hello, I'm Sean Arney, Supervisor for Elementary STEM. The purpose of this presentation is to provide incoming middle school families with an understanding of the math placement process. This presentation will provide an overview of the math courses offered in seventh grade, as well as provide a roadmap of math courses offered through graduation. Additionally, this presentation will provide families with an understanding of the assessments used for the recommendation for course placement. Understanding that all students learn differently, the goal of the placement process is to schedule students into courses that best match their potential for growth, achievement, and success. Hello, my name is Donna Dome, and I am the Secondary STEM Curriculum Supervisor. Starting in seventh grade, there are three math courses available. 2106 AK, which is a one-year algebra course, 2076, which is pre-algebra 6-0, and 2075, which is pre-algebra 5-0. For students who qualify for Algebra 1 in 7th grade, they will take Geometry in 8th grade, Algebra 2 in 9th grade, Pre-Calculus in 10th grade, AP Calculus AB in 11th grade, and AP Calculus BC in 12th grade. Please notice that students will earn their first math credit needed for graduation while enrolled in Algebra 2. Math courses taken in 7th and 8th grades do not count toward graduation credits. Algebra 1 in 7th grade is a very rigorous course. It is intended for students who are developmentally ready for the abstract nature of advanced math courses and want to reach AP Calculus BC by senior year. In this pathway, students skip two years worth of math standards. Therefore, it is intended for students to have mastered addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division of positive numbers, negative numbers, fractions, and decimals without a calculator. Be advised that students will take the Algebra Keystone at the end of seventh grade. The majority of the students will be placed into Pre-Algebra 2076. This course is a combination of seventh and eighth grade math standards, and it is for students who are ready at the end of Pre-Algebra 2076 they will move on to Algebra 1 in 8th grade, Geometry in 9th grade, Algebra 2 in 10th grade, Pre-Calculus in 11th grade, and AP Calculus AB by 12th grade. Students enrolled in Algebra 1 in 8th grade will take the Algebra Keystone at the end of 8th grade. Please notice that the first math credit earned while enrolled in this pathway is Geometry. For students who need more explicit instruction on the 8th grade math standards before moving on to algebra concepts, we have a two-year algebra course comprised of algebra operations and equations in 8th grade and algebra functions and data representations in 9th grade. Students will take the algebra keystone at the end of 9th grade. Students in this pathway will take geometry in 10th grade, algebra 2 in 11th grade, and pre-calculus in 12th grade. Students enrolled in this pathway will earn their first math credit in algebra functions and data representations. For students who require math intervention and would benefit from explicit instruction in all Math 7 and Math 8 standards, we have Pre-Algebra 2075. This course addresses all grade level standards while filling gaps students may have in their prior learning. Students in this pathway will take algebraic concepts in 8th grade, algebra operations and equations in ninth grade, algebra functions and data representations in 10th grade, geometry in 11th grade, and algebra 2 in 12th grade. The sixth grade placement rubric is designed to help teachers organize assessment results and recommend placement for students as they transition to seventh grade math. The criteria used for recommending students for seventh grade math placement are percentile ranking from the STAR 360 assessment, the iReady Diagnostic Quintile National Norm, and the Algebra Prognostic Score, also known as the Orleans HANA. Each assessment reflects a point value based on individual student performance results. Student placement for seventh grade math relates to how they performed on the related assessments. Overall, the assessment serves as a predictor for the correct course placement for math. The Orleans HANA is a problem-solving assessment used to predict a student's readiness for algebra. Students are not expected to be prepared for this assessment. The Keystone exam is a state assessment that is administered in May. This assessment is an end-of-course test for all students. 
If you have any questions on the math placement process, please feel free to contact your child's math teacher, guidance counselor, middle school principal, or curriculum supervisor. Thank you very much.